So the other day I ventured down to Blue Water with Becca Rose, Amy Valentine and the blog programme. We went to go visit Magnetone and also Pixie Lot. We got to meet some of you guys at a meetup which was really cool. So thank you to those that came and said hi. It was really nice to meet you and have some selfies. That was always lots of fun. So after we had the meetup we then got to interview Pixie Lot and we all decided why not do a tag. So we did the TMI tag. We split this into three. So this is part two. I'll also link down below. Becca's is part one. Amy is part three. I did modify some of the questions. I didn't really feel comfortable asking what her turn on and turn off was in a room full of people. Um, so I have changed some of the questions. I also asked some questions you guys put to me on Facebook. So I hope you enjoy this. Also stay tuned to after my part of the TMI tag if you want to see the stuff I got. Uh, Blue Water were really generous and they gave us a shopping voucher to spend. So if you want to see where I went and the stuff I got then stay tuned to the end. Hi guys, so I'm here today with Pixie Lot and Magnetone. Nicely placed here. <laughs> so I've got some questions to ask you, so let's get straight into it. Yes. So with your Magnetone Lucid device, what is your cleanser of choice? My cleanser of choice. I actually love La Roche Posay. Do you know that? It's really good. Um, I think it's really good quality stuff, so that's why I've been using it at the moment. I recommend. Oh, I have to try and get that. Yes. And also, um, I put on my Facebook for my followers to ask you some questions. I've got three here. So the first one is, who is your idol? My idol, musically or in just general. in general. Okay, in general, I'm going to say my mum. <laughs> Um, what's your go-to hair product? Go-to hair product? Well, for me, I think as a blonde, um, I like to have a bit of volume in my hair. So if it's ever flat or just looking a little bit lacking or something, dry shampoo. Oh, All the way. Revives. Yeah. <laughs> but I do still, I use it every day. Just to I have quite a few volume. of those, like the different differences. Do you use it? Really nice. your hair. Yeah, on those days, you, know, you don't want to wash, overwash your hair. Exactly, yeah. and it's, it's good to just give that bit of messy volume. That's what I like. And um, what are you hoping for for Christmas? For Christmas, well, to be honest, I'm just looking forward to just chilling out with my family yeah, and my loved ones. It's been such a busy year, and I've been scooting around all over the shop, so it's going to be so nice to chill. And I'm the biggest Christmas person ever, so I love everything that goes along with Christmas, like Christmas shopping, movies, Christmas music, Christmas lights. I'm excited that we're here at Blue Water and they've got the reindeers with the lights <laughs> on the outside. Um, so I'm just looking forward to that. Let's do some of the TMI questions. So, um, who's your favourite actor? My favourite actor, what, guy? Or could it be an actress? Anyone? Anyone? I'm going to say Julia Roberts. I love that. Yeah. Um, and do you prefer singing loudly or singing quietly? Loudly. <laughs> Spell it out. Yeah. If you could have brightly coloured hair, what colour would you go for? Because I just couldn't obviously make up my Decide. mind. Decide. So <laughs> I think you've done a great job. I dyed it myself. Did you? No, you didn't. How did you do that? And um, extensions and like a tint brush. And a tint brush. Well, I don't know if you've noticed today. Put a little bit of um, hair chalk in the end Ooh, to give I it a slight know. pink. Would you ever go all over? Give it a go. I think, you know, you only live once. You Watch this thing. Give it a go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, reasons you started to hear? Um, reasons... Uh, I wish there was a reason. It just sort of, re like, happened from when I was a baby. I sort of, like, not know anything else. I think I just always listen to music and be so in awe of it. And in awe of the amazing singers. Like, I grew up listening to all these big vocalists, like... Mariah and Whitney and Celine Dion. You're singing in your bedroom and like a hairbrush. Yeah, just going <laughs> for it in the mirror. And so I think that's what inspired me to want to do what they did. Yeah. But I've just always loved it. Um, let's kind of do a few more. There's so many, but let's go into your favourite film like, at the moment, recent one you've liked. My favourite film at the moment, it feels like I haven't been to the cinema in ages, so I need to get around to that. Yeah, what is that at the moment? Um, what was the one I saw? What's the one that's in space? Interstellar? I love that. What's it called? Interstellar? Interstellar. I love that. I haven't seen it. Do we, do I haven't seen any new movies. It's three hours. I still haven't got around to seeing Frozen. And I, haven't, I haven't seen you it You haven't either. seen it either. Which is why don't hate us. 
everyone can't believe hey, that I haven't I watched it. Yeah. Private screen. <laughs> yeah, we need Get to, out of the way. We need to go and see it. What's the last book you read? Um, I hate to say it. Because they don't. <laughs> I haven't actually, yeah, it's more magazines. <laughs> read some magazines you've read. Um, I, I do get French Vogue delivered to the house, I always get that. And I love that because they always have the most amazing shoots. And it's always good to look through magazines like this is inspiring. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Cool. Well, I won't do any more. I don't want to like run it over time. <laughs> but thank you so much for answering the questions. Thank I hope you. you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys soon. Thanks very much. On to the haul. Hi, if you are still watching. So I first went into Topshop. I saw these from afar and was like, these are really nice. Then realised they were actually what Becca was wearing that day. So we are now trouser twins, trouser buddies. Yep, worn them, not done up. Standard, standard. So I got them in my normal size. These are nice. They are not low rise, they're not high waisted, but they fit quite nicely. They have belt loops. Um, they are undone. So I just zip them up. They are a cigarette pant, so they do come up slightly short, but I quite like that. I think that looks really flattering. It does kind of lengthens the leg. It's not too short, but it's a flattering, a flattering short. They are nice because they don't look like pajamas. Sometimes when I wear trousers, I just worry this looks like I'm wearing pyjamas but these are fitted really nicely so they don't look baggy and the material is kind of thicker than some of the trousers I have so I don't have that problem. I also got some black jamies which I've worn so I don't know where I've put them but they're just black skinny jeans and they have the rips at the knee. Um, I wanted them in a kind of black Joni style so they sit higher but they actually sit fairly high so I'm really really happy with those. I saw quite a few people had them like Yanni and Pretty Sickly had them and they just look so nice. Um, I also got them in a 30 leg so they look really good because they hit me at the right length. I have to roll them up and got more bottoms, more check kind of style and yep not done up. These are the Jonies, um, they are the kind of new technology stretchy thing because they are in a length 32. I have to roll them but I really like the kind of contrasting white and the um, stripes of those. And then that sprinted to All Saints and I got this which is a lot for what it is but I really wanted it. I felt very, like I wore these, um, this top and my Jamie jeans the other day and I felt very much like Yannin from Pretty Sickly because she has a lot of these um, All Saints tops. I think they're All Saints her ones. Um, she does shop in All Saints a lot and she also has, as I mentioned, the Jamie jeans. So yeah, when I wore this I really felt like I had kind of Yannin vibes going on. Um, so it's just a simple v-neck. I don't really wear this kind of style but I find it really flattering um, because I don't know, I just feel like it's a bit more dressy than a normal t-shirt when wearing jeans. I don't often wear a t-shirt and jeans, it's usually a crop top and jeans but the material of this is really nice and so it should be because this guy is, this was £40 which is a lot. It is a lot but it was a voucher so I didn't feel as bad. I then ventured into Urban Outfitters and I got this which I've always wanted a skull. I want to put like know, sunglasses on it or um, like floral head crowns on it. It's a money box. It has a little thing at the back and also so you can get the money out. They had it in lots of colours. They had it in gold, black, red velvet. I'm not really sold on that but I like this. It's kind of like a dark silver that makes sense. And then I got this bag, this was in the sale, this was £20 reduced from 42 which I thought was really great. I love the look of this. The faux croc and the burgundy is really nice. I do have a lot of bags but I don't have one in this colour is my excuse. It's still brand new, it's still all got packaging stuff but um, the straps are adjustable. Uh, it has a zip at the back. It's very spacious it has um, like a zip inside as well and this is by <gasps> Dean and Ozzy. I don't even know it was or was it Dina and Ozzy? Um, I had some of their shoes before from Urban Outfitters so I thought this was a bargain they also had this in black painting um, style but that wasn't reduced that was still £42 but I really like this and for £20 I thought it was really good it's so pretty 
then picked up this, I had £3 left on my gift voucher and this was £2. Batiste, I was talking about this with Pixie, this is, if you watch the video, one of the things that she said she likes using. She didn't name drop the brand but I did that for her and this is the Cherry Scent. I haven't got this one. It smells okay! It doesn't fully smell like cherries but it's nice to have a travel size. The other ones I've got are like the really big size so I really like this in days, you know, when you you kind of need to wash your hair but you can't be bothered then this stuff is great also if you have any other recommendations of good dry shampoo please let me know because I've only ever really used this stuff so that was the end of my TMI tag and my haul and everything that I did a massive thank you to Magnetone the blogger program Blue Water to Pixie and I had so much fun and it was really nice to hang out with the other girls and I hope you enjoyed this video please comment like and subscribe and thank you for watching and don't forget to check part one and two I'll link those below.